This is no ordinary classroom environment. For these incarcerated men, education is the key to unlocking their full potential. I dropped out in like 10th grade, so that was it. But with the help of the teachers here and the education program here, I finally got my high set. The teachers here at Bill Johnson Correctional Center in Alva promote a culture of compassion, understanding, patience, and flexibility. It also allows our students to grow, thrive, and learn, and to become very successful. So successful, more than two dozen men earned their high school diplomas this week. How's it feel to get your um, high school diploma? Man, wonderful. It's, uh, it's uh, definitely a... Uh, a big feat that I've been trying to do for 30 years now, you know? <laughs> so I'm excited. Their studies meet the same rigors as a standard high school education, satisfying all state requirements. I see men who, who really want to succeed. You have everything within you to make you a success. And the only way you don't become a success is if you choose not to be. Mr. Dagan Oliver. Mr. Hayden Greenlee. Congratulations, sir. Step in the right direction. I'm, I'm excited. I'm ready to go. Feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. I'm proud of myself. My family's proud of me. With the love, support, and encouragement of family, and that diploma in hand, their horizons are now beaming with infinite possibility. I now present to you all the graduating class of 2022 for Bill Johnson Correctional Center.